Good evening, my friends. This is Paul, and tonight I'm going to make a short and snappy review of a short and snappy game known as Kirby's Blowout Blast for the 3DS. I wasn't originally intending on picking this up. I sort of had my fill of Kirby after Planet Robobot, and the Kirby Star Allies demo on the Switch was really, really boring. So I just figured, okay, I'm done. I will wait until Smash Brothers if I need more Kirby. Well, then I went to go buy a game on the eShop, and it was only after I added the funds that I found out what the game had in it. And I said, well, I don't want this game now, but yet I still paid the money, so I said, what game on the eShop should I get? Well, I decided to give Blowout Blast a try. I mean, it's basically a, an expansion pack to Kirby 3D Rumble from Planet Robobot. And I basically got what I paid for. You get five extremely short and boring worlds where Kirby moves around in a sort of top-down perspective. He sucks up enemies with his giant mouth and spits them back out to hit other enemies. You can collect coins and create combos to get more points. There's a boss battle at the end of each world. And there's a very predictable final battle, which will go down effortlessly if you're a Kirby fan at all. There's pretty much no platforming to be found, and they're basically just jumping over little ledges if there is. I only recalled twice in the entire game did I need to actually use Kirby's move, and the only true highlight I found out of this game was the music. I really liked how they took familiar Kirby tunes and presented them in a very different way, especially the final battle theme. It definitely was not what I was expecting. Um, the game is compatible with every Kirby series amiibo, which basically gives you another statue and an alternate music track to play on the plaza, but it's pretty much random, and you can't use non-Kirby amiibos, so that's kind of a joke. You can get medals, bronze, silver, and gold, depending on how well you did in the level, and if you get a gold medal on every level in a world, then you can unlock the extra version, and there's also a secret path. Me, I found myself so bored throughout this entire experience that I didn't see the need to persevere beyond the regular five worlds the game had to offer. It's fun enough if you liked 3D Rumble, but definitely not worth the $7 price tag. I would only get this if you're either a really hardcore Kirby fan or you have a gift card you have a little bit of money left over and you can't think of anything else on the eShop. Anyway, thank you very much for watching my review, and until the next time, keep the faith, stay epic, and God bless. Bye.